All right, so here it is here. <laughs> this is the story. <laughs> I had to put this up because it made me laugh when I just read the first line. So it was Anthony Knockard. Is not is it Knockard? I don't even know how to pronounce it. Knock A E R T. Knockard. Knockard. I'm gonna call him. I'm gonna call him Anthony, the brother who took the penalty. Let me show you his face real quick. Him there. That brother. Oh, the dark hair. Yeah, the one with the dark hair. He missed yeah, the penalty. Yeah. I, you know, you know I, if I remember it rightly, I think he dove. He dived. It wasn't even a penalty. But they got the penalty. Then he missed the penalty. And then their man broke. And then Tini went and scored. But some dramas happened on, <laughs> with him and, and fans. I think he's like, you don't got to get over it. So let me just read this real quick. So the former Leicester winger, Anthony, slammed the fans of unstable Watford after being bombarded with references to his missed penalty in the 2013 Championship Playoff semi-final. Anthony, 32 now, st started for Leicester against um, Watford at Vicarage Road 11 years ago. Yeah, <laughs> there's him right there. With the score 2-2 on aggregate, he stepped up to take a penalty on the 97th minute, but the effort was saved by ex-Arsenal man Amulia. You get me, Manuel Amulia, <laughs> remember him? You get me? Yeah, yeah, yeah. The Spanish brother who wanted to get citizenship so he could be the England keeper. I remember. Keeper, that's right. That's right. <laughs> you made me laugh, but hold on. Watford then went straight to the other end with um Hogg set up Troy Dini for a dramatic late winner. Over the decade, on the um, iconic match, Anthony has a bizarre hit out at the Watford fans for calling, for calling them clowns in a social media rant. On his Instagram story, the ex-winger wrote, OK, just to make it clear, you guys keep writing, here's, here's hog or whatever. Listen, listen, you clowns. Without me, you would never experience a playoff final in, at Wembley that you lost. Kevin Phillips, you remember? You all, you all that stupid that you that you are even writing this like this. You, what? You all that stupid that you are even writing this like you made it. Oh, okay. How to describe Watford Football Club. Unstable and has six different managers per season. So please enjoy your life and leave me alone for once. <laughs> so basically, them man there, every so often, they remind him of Wagwan and he don't like it no more. <laughs> and you know what? You know what it is? You just have to take it. This is what it is. Shit happens, and sometimes it just sticks to you for life. And it, looks, it is still crazy, crazy, because I, still I, I'm carrying things from eleven years ago. I'm telling you, fives. I'm sure he dove. He got the penalty. Yeah, and he was. That's and why it, I missed it. Uh, his chest he was dove. high, like he was going to yeah. tuck it in and then win the game. It's like, I always yeah. say this: anyone who gets fouled, you should never be the penalty taker because your yeah. emotions yeah. are too high. Yeah, yeah. You're not calm. Yeah. You're not calm. You're so eager. I want to be the golden boot. I want to be the glory boy. I want to be the oh, hero. Yeah, I want to be the newspaper, isn't it? Think of yeah, the I want to be the front page. page. I took this to the to premiership and all that. That's what he's a glory boy shit. <laughs> but he fucked up because he never had the mental fortitude. Facts. Facts. You know what I'm saying? The concentration span. This is what I say about IQ and, you know, breathing. And, you know, yo, you ever see Cristiano Ronaldo? You ever see when my man goes like a penalty or a team? My man takes the ball, he takes two breaths. <sighs> in here? Yeah. <sighs> Go on. <laughs> <laughs> two breaths. One, two, and it's always a goal. Yeah. Always a goal of the penalty spot when it comes to Ronaldo. Always, blood. Always. always. There's nothing yeah, else. You know you know but you know what? This brother, this brother aside, if you think of everyone, Zidane, he would all the headbutt would always come back. You know what mm -hmm. I'm saying? The headbutt would always come back. As great as Terry Henry is, that handball against Ireland, that would always come back. But you know what, but you know what covers that, that will never die down. But you, never. Know what, but you know what covers all of that? You know what covers all of that? That they win and they've got a World Cup medal. So that's yes, <laughs> yes. No, you're right. You're right. No, no, that, that, that's, that's, that. That, would be, that would be their comeback and it would be a great fuck. Is that your fire alarm? <laughs> I'm gonna, I'm gonna mute you because that's annoying. Let put when you come back, just put your thumbs up and then let me know when you're you're good to go. But yeah, people. So in general, things stick to you. And like Five said, yeah, if you're a winner, you can most most more likely shrug it off because you've won. But someone like this brother here, when he's 
he got what happened to him. This is like the biggest thing that happened to you. You get me? It's like stick on you. And there's nothing that you can say because I don't think he's won anything, Mr. Anthony Knocker. I don't think he's won. He doesn't won anything. So, yeah, you're, you're right. As in, no one's going to be like, oh, Zinedine, all you've ever done was headbutt, man. No one could ever say that. You could never <laughs> say that. Right. You get me? They're going to say that, Zidane. And, they can talk about the Real Madrid goal. Yeah. They can talk about this World Cup final hitters. They can talk about a, a, a middle. Yeah, he's, yeah, about, he's, a, he's one of the best, bro. You never yeah, so that covers all of that. That covers, yeah, yeah, that was, covers all of that. Because I, I remember, I remember when it happened, the headbutt happened. I remember the commentators were like, "Ah, oh, ZZ, nah, this is all you're gonna be remembered for." I was like, "Don't be stupid, no, blood. No, don't be silly. If, any, if anything, you're gonna have to remind man that he headbutt man. Right. He's done too much. Yeah, too much. Have to, too much. Have to remind man, yo, remember when ZZ headbutt man because he insulted his sister. <laughs> Boom." Hold that's the one that's the one thing you can say, but I believe that he's Zidane is a is a, 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 a winner. Yeah, straight, bro, straight. <laughs>